Hello, this is Kent C once again here, and I'm doing the Dell Latitude 531 uh, laptop disassembly. So let's take a look here real quick. I don't want to take too much of the foolishness here. Okay. So here is your basic kit. This is all you're going to need to <laughs> and install it. Uh, we went ahead and this has got two uh, dim slots. Slot A is right here. Slot B, well, it's upside down, but there it is. All right. So I'm going to leave that in there because I know that one's tested. It's good. You're doing your disassembly. Make sure to put your screws, leave them in the part or tape them like I have here. There's one screw in the fan. Okay, this part was already there like that, so I'm kind of wondering what happened. See, there was two screws in this, so I taped it. Um, see, the screws, you know, there's a screw here, excuse me, a screw here, and a screw here. Okay, so you can see I taped them in, and then there's one here. And they're, they're marked. There's like one, two, three, so you know there's three there that hold this unit down, this whole piece. There's more actually, but the main three, one, two, three, and you gotta, and this thing just comes up once you take off the back parts that hold, you know, the screws that hold this together, excuse me, that hold all this together. This should just pop right up, you know what I mean? And then you just gotta make sure you get these, which are by the keyboard. Okay, so the keyboard, you know, let me, I should have taped those three, but that's fine. What you're going to see, there's one slot right there. There's one slot right there. There's one slot right there. You know, when this is all put together, it sits like this. So the first thing you want to do is start, you know, around here. Like I said, this is my toolkit tape. This little dinky uh, pocket screwdriver, which you can get at, you know, 99 cent store for a dollar. It comes with, excuse me, it comes with this. So you get those two, and then just like any kind of card, like a, you know, credit card type. So I have a GameWorks one right here. And then thermal grease, because once you open it up, you know, let's make sure it's clean. Okay, as far as this laptop, the uh, screen itself, it's going to have a little mic piece. The mic piece is going to be in here. See, whoops. See kind of where I'm, I'm angling it so you can see the connector is right below that. It's right here, where my finger is. Boom, 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 boom. Oops, it's kind of bad there, but right here. Where you see the word modem, so it's that slot right there. And that this will connect to it. You just lift up. It's got a little ribbon. It's got a little thing. You're just gonna lift it. You're gonna lift it up like so. This piece up. That's all you're gonna do. Um, as far as everything else, uh, these are color coordinated. So black here. White there, once again, disconnected to this, so it's going to be taped around like so. So you just lift up, see how the, these are? So once you, and there's a third one that'll be here, it'll sit in a little slot. You're just going to lift all the way up and it comes out. Alright, that's how that one goes. And as far as the hinge itself, you're like wondering how the screen went. So they sit inside. Are these pieces right here? See this? Kind of rehold it for you. You see this right here? So it sits in like this. See how that one? But it would it'd be the whole thing, but it sits in that. So when you put it back together, you just meow, and it sits in like that. That's on both sides. All right. 
point and everything else is pretty much you know self-explanatory like hard drive you would once you're done slide it but opposite you know uh, battery would go in you know this doesn't have any screws that you need to plug into it the DVD uh, ROM drive we're just gonna plug in like so so you're just gonna kind of I'm gonna do this one it's gonna slide right in other than that <clears throat> you know I'm just here to fix this I'm just gonna show you the last piece so this is the uh, heat sink let's take a look whoa that is dirty that is really bad that's probably why this thing is powering the reason I'm doing this uh, is because this will not stay uh, on this keeps powering off so I figured let's take a look and clean up the inside since everything else seems to be working order but not so uh, that's the basic uh, instructions for you you know I tried to find this online and I couldn't so I just kinda did it myself uh, like I said that's you know that's your kit right there I mean you don't even need this that's that's your that's your basic kit one card, one mini screwdriver, fill up head, tape, and thermal grease, which cost me a buck. So this whole thing probably cost me about a little bit, little less than three bucks. All right, and that's how you can repair your uh, machine and at least get down to it and fix it. Like I said, slot A dim on the back, slot B, okay, and uh, that's pretty much it. This is Ken C. Uh, thank you very much. Oh, once again, this is Kent C. Okay, so on the north bridge here and the CPU, I went ahead and put thermal paste. This had a thermal pad, but I still put it on. That's fine. Cleaned it off. To clean off that, you know, I just used, uh, you can see I got a little debris on there. You just scrape off the access, you know, like clean it, you know, something like that real fast, and then you're good to go. Um, just kind of kind of show you once again, so you need to make sure that you have this plugged in this plugged in And you do the uh, you know Wi-Fi card here the uh, attachment preferable uh, Black on black white on white baby, and then you're gonna just bring the uh, Like I said, you can see that I got the screw in well not the screw in but the you know mount in okay so everything is there once again like i said just you know plugged into nothing so leave it um it's important to note you see the number m25 by 5 so that's those are indicators okay that that goes to the actual you know motherboard or you know the pcb <laughs> Let me get technical. Okay, and then right here, these, I don't know if you can see it. The M2 0 by 3, those three, there's one. There's the second one under there. And the ribbon would be, of course, kind of slid in a little cleaner. And then, whoops, excuse me. Uh, and then the third one. A little bit cleaner view that's actually where your keyboard will uh, have its screws okay so you don't mess that up uh, other than that like I said um, you know there's a place here you get the feed it will say mic let me bring it down a little bit say mic so what you yeah, so what you do so you're gonna actually feed well let's see if I can do it while I'm filming okay yeah see so you're gonna feed that through like so. Go ahead, it's all good. I'm just gonna give it a nice little, you know, stick right there, okay? So you saw how I did that. Kind of fed that through. It'll say MIC right there. Okay, then you take this ribbon piece, boom. You're gonna connect it just like that. See how it lifts up? So you can grab that, pull it up, you're going to just push it, you're going to secure it. Let's 
so you know it's in there. That's how you make sure. All right, Mrs. Kinsey, thank you very much.